Well, here I am. What now, Cappy? You forgot already? Aye, it took almost an hour to get up here, Cappy, and Lucky and me's been dodging hungry me was the old way. Honestly, I'm surprised Lucky made it this far. Sorry, neighbors. Just open the auxiliary panel near the nose of the ship. Plug in the highly experimental Spitronian laser spitter and destroy that giant space amoeba before it wrecks the saucy commotion's paint job. Sounds too easy. It's a piece of cake. Would I lie to you? Are we counting the time you sent me to Planet Sludge Few because Dr. Zaniac needed a muck sample from a 50 foot tall sludge muck beast and then missed all my communicator screams for help? There was a lot of interference from the Nickelodeon Nebula, I told you. But what about the time the ship was under attack by the Blingons and you sent me and Flip out in a shuttlecraft to fend them off while the Curmudgeon escaped? The shuttle you gave us had no weapons on it, you know. A minor oversight on my part, but that's not important right now. This is not at all like the other suicide missions I've sent you on. Trust me. We're all rooting for you. <laughs> Captain Burnham out. Was... was that laughter I heard in the background? Oh, well, I suppose i better pop that meba so I can go back to bed. What this scene desperately needs is some appropriate music. Fortunately, I just happen to have some in me suit. That's more like it. Come on, Lucky. Yay! Hmm. Pushing Lucky into space would be fun, but then I wouldn't have anyone to do the dangerous work for me. This meba looks like an Arcturian steak. Mmm, yummy. Stop staring at me. I have a rule about keeping me hands to myself when around mile-wide hungry space monsters. I'm not sure I can toss him off the ship, even with biceps like mine. Well, if it ain't a little me by chewing on the ship, he's cute. Looks like the captain has a nice view of our impending doom. I can use this personal communicator to order Lucky about. Whether or not he's actually capable of following those orders is another thing. Me trusty hydro spanner. Good for fixing broke things and breaking fixed things. And throwing at things what annoy me. Me scanatron. I can use it to analyse things. Dr. Zaniac's really outdone himself this time. I wonder if it'll work though. Some cable old Zaniac gave me for powering the laser. It's a space wormian! Evasive action number none. Ineffective, Captain. It appears to be directly on top of us. Take it easy, fellas. It's just a cable. I knew that, PFC Limey. Carry on. This is a sausage I nicked from the galley and exposed to Element Z to distract the waste rats. It's a long story, but the sausage still looks delicious. Starfast are such pinch pennies they give out plastic medals. This one's for dubious bravery during the digestive war. I could use the last of the saucer's lubricant. I had a real moment of genius with this thing. It completely distracted Cappy so I could nick his medal. Yeah, I never go anywhere without it. Solar ants are energy collectors designed to help power the ship. They're all over the curmudgeon. Name me creation the span line. Here goes nothing. I better stay put till I decide what to do with this cable. All right, you bloody meba. Time to give back all that energy you've been stealing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
that's done him. Yay! Yay, indeed. Let's see if I can shake the line loose. There we are. Now to reel in the cable. Got it. I just undo this knot and... Presto! There we are. Oh, please. The blooming thing's been messed up and drained of power. Probably by that bloody little Meba. Now what am I supposed to do? Pretty light. What? Pretty light. You mean the solar ant? That's just an energy collector. Now keep it down. I'm trying to figure out a way to get us out of this mess alive. The spanner isn't going to help now. Yes, it's going to work. It's working. Bloody cheap, it still ain't working. I've half a mind to take me spanner to this thing and be done with it. I ain't sacrificing me spanner unless there's no other choice. Lucky old bean, I finally got a job you can do. Okay. Walk over to that panel there. Do you see those sparking wire ends there? I want you to grab them and hold them together. Got it? Okay. You can do it, Lucky. I can do it. Yay! You did it. I did it. Yay! All right, chum. Looks like the rest's up to me. Easy. There we are. It's time to connect this incredibly dangerous experimental laser up. Plug me in, Lucky. Okay! Alright, you single cell Dora. Let's see if you can digest Spectronium laser. It's working. Dr. Zaniac actually made something that works for once. You're going down, hideous gigantic Meba. Uh, Cappy, the Spectronians just started beeping at me. Should I be worried? Certainly not. Dr. Zaniac assures me that the laser only beeps when it's overheating. Ah. Wait, did, did you say overheating? Relax, PFC line. It's just a precaution to notify the user that the gun is approaching safety limits. So what does it mean when the gun starts glowing? I'll consult with Dr. Zania. The doctor sends his condolences, <coughs> compliments, on a job on the desk. What about the laser? Oh, he mentioned to me earlier that in his case, he'd forgotten to make an off switch. I should have told you earlier, but you know my memory. The plug fuse to the laser. Bloody hell. I think I've just discovered a new frontier of horrific pain. for a walker. Uh oh, the boss. Better cheese it. Aha! Where do you think you're going, Rhymey Rizard? Nuts. I was just going to, uh, to get me grime gun. Yeah. You know how it is in the disposer sub levels. A fella can't get a thing done without his grime gun. So I'll just pop off and... You used that trick on me a week ago, Imbashiric Reptire! Are you sure it was me, you see? Lots of blokes work on this sub-level. Heck, it could have been Flip. 
Don't try to confuse me. I have perfect memory. And I've seen to it that you have a spare set of tours handy, just in case. Figures, you sidewinding. What was that? Come closer so I can hear you query. Now, I've been going over your performance record and... My what? Your performance record. Oh, record. Right. That's what I say. According to Panda, you have been absent from work no fewer than 25 times this solar month alone. I can see me not working 20 days, but 25? You've got the wrong bloke, Gov. Stop interrupting! Panda is incapable of mistakes, which is why she will be monitoring this loom to make sure you do your job. Furthermore, if you try to leave this loom before your shift ends, I will be notified. And then I will pass on your leco to Captain Bailnab. He'll find a suitable punishment for your indiscretions. Issy old chum, do I police you while you work? HA! A white glade employee policing an age glade. It could happen. Remember that parallel universe where I was the captain of a drunken parrot? That sheep was a garbage scow. Even in that universe you were at bottom end of food chain. Come to think of it, the me in that universe was a bit of a knob. He wouldn't even give me some crisps when I was starving. Just get your buttocks in gear, fat boy, or else you'll be shaving the captain's bunions with the other Z-glades. Ever consider some sensitivity courses, Issy? Make sure he does his job, Panda, starting with that match by the display. Of course. And stop calling me hissy! This is just great. Well, I suppose I could get started after a nap. And I can inform Mr. Hissington that you are sleeping on the job. Or I could get some work done right now. I might be able to clean that goop up with me hands. That would be one of the more moronic actions you've performed lately. The viewport doesn't open like a window, which I'm fairly certain's a good thing. Yep, that space. I see it every day. Blimey, someone did a notice behind that pipe. Let's see here. Blimey, I don't know any of these blokes. They must be new. Blimey, if it ain't a service panel, I'm clueless about what it's for. I really don't know what this is. People throw away the strangest things. There's no way I could lift that, let alone fit it in me overalls. Some bloke left his lunch pail here. Hmm, looks like someone left their lunch pail behind. And what's this? An LCD. My LCD. I was wondering where you've gotten off to. Bloody thieves. Can't trust nobody on this ship. Why not? If this cup can handle the dots concoctions, it can handle anything. Here we are. One cup full of goop. I'd better be careful with this. If I've really got to get into the waste disposer, this is the way. You have work here to complete, PFC Limey. Nag, nag, nag. You gotta love a job where you're paid nothing to stand on your tootsies for eight hours in front of a ruddy console. If you had not spent all your time spinning in your chair, they would not have taken it away. Chair racing is a completely legitimate sport. Besides, Flip challenged me, and I never turned down a challenge. Everything appears to be working fine. It doesn't connect to anything as far as I know. An old disused waste chute. Boy, that looks like a grime gun. That'd do that goop in no time. 
I predict a 98.73% chance of failure should you try to take the grind gun from your current position. Well, I'll just have to think of something else, won't I? I can't reach it with that goop in the way. I can't... The steam shooting out of this pipe makes a pleasant little tune. Pushing on it would probably just break. Messing with the levers when there ain't a pressure problem is a good way to start one. As long as those eyes are staring at me, I ain't sticking my hand anywhere near it. That's odd. There's a huge section of the wall missing. What's this about, Panda? Routine maintenance. Some wiring needed repairs. And PFC Flip reported hearing muffled screams coming from inside the wall. Of course, you would already know this, if you read the duty logs, or even, Great Tortoise Forbid, showed up for work. Always gotta get your nails in, don't ya? Why don't you go chew some virtual bamboo or something? Ah, must not be a waste back back there after all. Let's see what's back here. Hmm, there's nothing inside. This is me finished. I can see some light coming through a panel in the wall. I've stuck my hands in worse things before. Oh, come on! Where is it? Got it! It's too dark over there to see anything. And I'm not sure I want to see whatever it is anyway. I sure hope this thing don't have teeth. Ow! The son of a bit me! Time to teach this goop a lesson. Limey lizard style. Run, gun, go! Terminated. Wow, that goop ate right through the paint. Good thing I didn't touch the stuff. Well, I'd say that deserves a lunch break. That figures. What's wrong now? One moment. It appears that several waste processing pipes have become plugged. Easy. Just flush the system. Even I know that. Four attempts have been made to do so without success. You will have to go down there and unplug them manually. To the disposer barrels? Sod that. But... I may be lazy, but I know my job, and crawling around through the waste tubes ain't part of it. Do you realise what will happen if the pipes remain in their current state? Yeah, the disposer will start belching filth back out. Which reminds me, I'd better get out of here. Wait, the pipes in question are right beside the entrance to the grotto. That's great and all, but I've got an appointment with some meat pies and a comfy bed. I may be willing to forget part of Mr. Hissington's report to the captain. Part? Oh, very well. Or... Now will you go? I'll have it fixed in no time. Sometimes the bacterializers in the waste processor can't break something up, and when that happens we have to go fish it out. This box is where some of the less interesting stuff gets stored for disposal later. Let's see what's in here. There's mountains of junk! Blimey, someone threw out a perfectly good Void Quest doll. Well, it's mine now. Might as well give it another look, just in case. An afro? Maybe someone had it for fancy dress week. Let's try this again. Oh, blog, I got filth on me hands. Here we go. That was far too easy.
Gah. It stinks down here even worse than usual. All right, let's get this done quickly. Hey, I don't see any plug pipes over here. That is because there are none. But you said it was right outside the elevator. A slight exaggeration on my part. You will find the pipes in question in section Z of the Disposer Grotto. You call that a slight exaggeration? Nobody, nobody said I'd have to crawl through that filth to fix any pipe. The Disposer is rapidly approaching critical mass PFC limey. So send down Lucky then. He can wade through that muck while I supervise. Impossible. Power to the elevator was disabled as soon as you arrived. Disabled? You double-dealing artless cow. I can no more override safety protocols than you can overcome your aversion to work. Fine. So I just find these pipes, get rid of whatever's plugging them up and I can get out of here? Not quite. Several pipes seem to have ruptured from the pressure build-up. Those will have to be repaired as you find them. Great. I really should have stayed in bed today. Well, at least I wore me chemically resistant overalls today. No oh, good. These things won't open until the disposer returns to normal. I'm getting out of here. What the... Why is the elevator not working? The elevator will remain sealed until you repair the disposer. What if I can't repair it? Then I suggest you practice your swimming. Bloody hell. Looks like a bunch of pipes are clogged somewhere in the grotto. I hate the grotto. It's so mucky. What's this? A bunch of pipe patches. These will come in handy. Oh, this is well and truly disgusting. I can't believe I have to do this for a few creds a month. Well, best hurry and get it done. And by hurry, I mean move as carefully as possible. The last thing I want is to fall head first into this filth. This goop is harmless to most life forms, but I wouldn't trust it. Right, here. I can remember the first time I got tripped the blood. Now I'm... A bunch of pipe patches. These will come in handy. People throw away the oddest things. Now who went and threw away a perfectly good boy quest doll? Some people are so thoughtless. That game was all the rage back on Crustacean Station. Time to teach this pipe a lesson. This pipe's fixed. It looks like Panda was right. Some of the pipes have burst from the pressure. Well, guess I better fix them. Something's taking a chunk out of this light. I don't even want to know what that stuff is. Time to teach this pipe a lesson. This pipe's fixed. It's an open access panel. Looks like something gooped it good. Time to teach this pipe a lesson. 
This pipe's fixed. Time to teach this pipe a lesson. This pipe's fixed. It's a visual map of the grotto. Blimey, it's broken. this. This ain't the right place either. And it looks like Flip's been doing graffiti again. The bloody thing's been gooped by something. That goop looks almost as bad as the stuff I cleaned off upstairs. And that ate clear through the paint. Bloody hell. This stuff's clinging to the metal like glue. The grime guns managed to loosen up the sludge, but I'm gonna need something to clear it off these blades if I want to get them spinning again. I knew this thing would come in handy. Better move, this thing's picking up speed. Look at it go! Hmm, I wonder what part of the ship this pipe handles pressure for anyway. Ah, there's nothing right private time with good book. That sound bad. Real bad. Help! I'm stuck! Daddy! Someone gonna pay for this. That's another job well done. You've been a true friend, Afro, but I gotta get rid of you before you eat through me overalls. Guess I better find the other clogged pipes before this place fills up with filth. It's a service ladder. Time to teach this pipe a lesson. That's the last of the pipes. I think. Looks like access to the WDU's been disabled. Hopefully I don't need to get in there. The only way into the Waste Disposal Unit Control Centre is through that door. There ain't any clogged pipes in there, that's for sure.
It displays the current flow levels in the grotto. The buttons just show flow levels on the other side of this grate to be normal. The curb up there is a bit too narrow for feet like mine. There's the source of the problem. Bloody waste rats, I should have known. What did you call me? You're going down, cheese face. A family of voice tracks have made a home in this pipe system. They're about to receive an eviction notice. Limey lizard style. We will need to remove at least 50 wave strats for pipe pressure to return to normal. I can take them. Can you do it in 30 seconds? That's how much time you have before the disposer reaches critical mass. Limey, let's get conking then. Incredible, you actually did it. Never underestimate the power of a spanner, Panda. You blokes messed with the wrong lizard today. Wait, I'm forgetting something. I told you you were going down, Ratty. Right down the drain. Ah, it's moments like this that almost make me job seem worthwhile. Time to get out of here before I lose my sense of smell entirely. What, no congratulations for a hero returning from the war? I must admit, PFC Limey, that you performed your duties most adequately. Do I detect the slightest hint of a compliment, Panda? I might faint. I fail to see the need to compliment you on a job half finished. What are you on about? I conked every last waste rat down there and flushed a lot of them. I am aware of that. However, the waste levels in the grotto have risen too high for the auto flushes to function. Which means what exactly? Which means you must return to the grotto and manually flush out the waste until it returns to acceptable levels. Manually flush? <laughs> I was only joking. Hello?
overplaying everybody. Too bad about Lucky, eh? Oh well, look out for more adventures starring me. And don't forget to eat your meat pies. See you again soon. Hello? Can anyone hear me? It's very dark down here. What's that noise? Oh no. Just choke on it. Then I'd be mining us mine minin? Why the do I keep saying mining? He'd just choke on it. And then I'd be mining a son and I keep doing it. He'd just choke on it. And then I'd be mining a sauce and na 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 I tried wearing it over the helmet earlier, but it just kept drifting up drifting. Easy peasy pudding and pie. Oh, there I go thinking about me stomach again. I'm not sure meddling with a gun pack full of adders. I'm not sure meddling with a gun pack full of adders. I flipping did it again. Go, go, Grime Gun. You're the best. Help, Limey Lizard. Clean up the mess. Some days I'd just like to blast the ship and everyone in it, and then I'd realise that I'd be able to be able to be Maybe if the kilometre was a few dozen cables long. The cable wouldn't eat. Eat. It wouldn't eat, because cables don't eat. I'd need a throwing arm like Lou Gatterig. Gatorig. Gatterig? I'd need a throwing arm like what's his name? And a lot more cable to manage that. Relax, PFC Limey. It's just a precaution to notify the user that the gun is over overheating. <clears throat> Crap! Sorry. I'll try that again. Relax, PFC Limey. It's just a precaution to notify the user that the gun is a pro. Whew, it's a long sentence. Whew, deep breath. The doctor sends his comp don't dead. The doctor sends his condolences, compliments on a job. Mm, shite, that was awful. One more time. Oh, he mentioned to me earlier that in his haste he'd forgotten to make an off switch. More. <laughs> this is not at all like the other suicide missions. <laughs> Sorry. My dog's doing something funny. Ah. Could you distrust a man who burps like this? I could say, so this shan't be a wasted shit after all. And that's a wrap. And then I will pass on your leco to pat. I know it is unfamiliar to you, which is why Panda will be a variable should you make a stupid mistake. That's no, too Tony Montana. Nothing else ha- Nothing else has worked with- Ugh. Nothing else- Nothing else has worked. Nothing else has worked with you. Just get your buttocks in gear, fat boy, or else you'll be shaving the captain's bunny and split the- Ah, there's nothing like private- <laughs> There's nothing right pli- Why do I keep- <sighs> I miss the hissing tone. I like to sing this song. I raise the stereotype. But I no got no gripe. It's very hard to rhyme. But I do it all the time. I covered in waste. So, I can't think of-